tutorial and this the watching the video series of how to create a bookshop management in visual c++ and in this video i am going to show you how to change the font size of the console window so there is a small function we need to create so i'm going to show this now mm, okay let's start the function i'm going to give the brief introduction for the function function to change the font size okay start with the void font so it doesn't return anything so font size okay all right so we will start the coding in between the curly braces and here okay short font x comma y okay so this these are the variables which is going to be entered by the user um, and it will manipulate as a font size uh, I'm going to put in a do while loop the user input as I showed you in earlier videos that uh, to you know the exception handling uh, you know while we enter user enters so many invalid inputs okay enter font size and C in font okay so this is the, this variable we are using to for the C in command by the users okay if font is greater than or equal to 25 or font less than equal to 5 so because this is the maximum limit and minimum limit we can uh, give for console window size or in sorry console font size so so better we define that size so it won't bring up any error if, if users enter more than or less than this value so we give that condition in if statement okay see out please enter font size so if less than 25 and greater than 5 so if they enter any invalid input so it will show this error message uh, to enter less than or, mm, uh, 25 and greater than 5 and error equal 1 and scene dot clear scene dot ignore okay so these are the thing I explained you already so I am not going to tell again scene dot fail out please enter a valid input and l and error equal one scene dot clear okay so there is a two if condition I have given so one if uh, font size is greater than or less than five and other one if font size may be this if you say enter some characters or any other uh, string or something like that so it will go inside this uh, if condition it will show this error message so that's why we have defined two exception handling method here okay so there is exception and there is many uh, way to uh, handle the exceptions but this is the uh, these are the one of the way but I'm going to show you other ways later on while error equal one okay x equal font and y equal to so i assign font value to x here and i assign uh, two uh, so i multiply x x value into two by two to and assign to the y so i will show you why it, why i did that and how this is the predefined uh, library for the window dot at header uh, fun uh, header library so this will it's output handling so we again we are going to handle the output of the windows and code font size and equal x comma y and console fonts in 4x font 
equal size of this one too. Okay, so get current console font short folds and font and here font dot d w font size f size now I'm, we are going to set the current console font size okay x zero and font so this is like a, you know we are giving these two parameters so this one we we detect what is the existing font size and here we are giving the new font size okay so these are the uh, predefined libraries so we don't need to uh, enter those codings uh, to how to change the font size so it's a it's a shortcut way so system dot cls is it will refresh the uh, application uh, sorry uh, the console window so this command okay all right so now we need to create a sorry call this function from the main menu okay so this is the function we are done already and we need to call this function from the main function okay so here is the main function okay I have called this one already so here case 4 font size so that is the name of the function and break it okay so that's all and you just save this one as a main 3 or main 4 you can use your own name so I give main 4 okay so I compile this main 4 dot CPP so it is compiling now and let me check is there any error available or is it all everything okay mm, I hope there won't be any errors okay so no errors so let's open that function mm. when you when you open a first time any function it will take some time but if you open second time it will come very fast okay so this application okay it's open the there's no error so let's check whether it's working or not font size changes here I give 12 okay yeah here it's changing the font size now let's try again 15 yes it's working perfectly so this is the way to change the console font size but uh, remember this uh, font size change will change the entire system of the font size so e even you exit the uh, console the font will be the same size for example I show you enter 0 see now we uh, exit uh, we have exited from the application but still the font size remains as the same so it is an uh, easy way to change the total console font size okay so now we have we are going to uh, do the function for the change team and we'll going to show you how to change the team and uh, create a function so in next video i'm going to do that so until that take care guys bye bye